Now on to news uh, that we continue to track on NDTV 24-7. The National Institute of Virology or the NIV gets more than 600 swab tests each day when it has a capacity to handle just about 300. So from a 24-hour deadline for the test results, it now takes a good 60 hours. So authorities now want to limit the number of tests they take and instead focus on studying the behavior of the virus. Kate Kiangre has the support. This is two-year-old Isaac's third trip to Naidu Hospital in the last 48 hours. He has fever, a sore throat, and he's breathless. His parents are all the more worried because they stay in the same lane as Dr. Baba Mani, Pune's third swine flu victim. We are actually very confused as to where to go and what to do right now because uh, we are just giving him the regular medicines right now, what uh, the crocins and uh, the, the normal uh, stuff. But uh, still, we don't know if he has H1N1 or not. And we have tested him on uh, Monday. My family physician, she told me she received five to six cases of swine flu. But she only told me, she only told me to go to Naidu Hospital. See, I'm standing here for no use. Still, I am in confusion my son is having or not. Like the Nayas, many others are spending anxious hours outside Pune's Naidu Hospital, waiting for a list that will tell them if they have swine flu. Their wait made longer by an overburdened National Institute of Virology. The NIV has a capacity of testing 300 samples a day, but currently is receiving three times that number. NIV officials say that they would rather put all their efforts behind finding out the behavior of the virus rather than focusing their attention on testing each and every sample. The outcome? It's taking over 60 hours for results to be sent back considerably longer than the earlier 24-hour period. This is what the NIV director says. The state government has decided symptomatic treatment can begin. Not all samples need to be checked. Treatment can begin even before test results come in if the patient shows severe symptoms. We want to see, in the larger scheme of things, how the virus is behaving. The NCDC people and the NIV sat together and decided that uh, treatment should be started immediately as the symptoms are also. Therefore, the suspected patients are being given a treatment. Families like the Nayas will be hoping that the decision kicks in quickly and children like Isaac get medical attention when they need it the most. With Kate K. Angre in Pune, Priyanka Kakodkar for NDTV.